three, two, one. What's up, losers? It's your boy, Kane Hazelton, also known as the next Pablo Picasso. And today, we are playing Mario Paint for the Super Nintendo. I bet you didn't know Mario was an artist. I did know that. What the? Before we start, I have to let you know this game actually comes with a mouse. It has the ball, but it plugs right into your Super Nintendo. It's pretty legit. So I got the Rocat Cane, and I got the Super Nintendo Mario Paint mouse. Let's get right into the news. Mario, come here. Oh, that's it. Come here. Come here. There we go. What was that? So I was thinking, since I have no idea how to paint, I am going to watch a tutorial by the one and only Bob Ross. Dan, this one's for you. I know how much you love Bob Ross. Wow, this <coughs> good at painting. That was good. Oh, Bob. Oh Hello, I'm Bob Ross, and I'd like to welcome you to the 29th Joy of Painting series. Today I'm using an 18 by 24 inch double prime pre-stretched canvas, but you use whatever size you'd like. And I've just covered the entire canvas with a very thin coat of liquid white. Dude, this game's the next level. You can change the sensitivity. The so let's get started. I thought today we'd just do a very simple little scene that I hope you'll enjoy. Let's start with a little two inch brush and a touch of the alizarin crimson. And we just load a little bit right into the bristles. Pull a little paint out, tap the bristles firmly to assure a nice even distribution of paint all the way through the bristles. And let's go. Maybe we'll have a little pink in the sky. I sort of like that. And in our world, we can do anything that we want to do here. Any old thing. There. It doesn't take too long when you're using a brush that's two inches wide. And still using a little crisscross strokes, X's. That's all they are, little X's. We'll just apply a little bit of the phthalo blue. Something For some reason, I feel like so. I'm doing this wrong. Then we'll come back after we clean the brush and blend that together. Now the blue is mint. Let's have some water in this painting. I love water. And it's very easy to I paint I also in the love style. water. <laughs> still water is always level. And I think today we'll have still water. So pull from the outside in. Outside in. Something about like so. I can't, Bob. All right. I can't do that, Bob. I'll have a little. The most fun part of this whole technique is washing the brushes. No. Since these are oil paints, we're washing our brushes with odorless paint thinner. Shake off the excess. And <laughs> and just beat the devil out of it. That's really the most fun part of it. Now, with a clean brush. What was that? Relatively dry from just beating. What we're doing? Something about my cat. There. And we don't know where that goes. It doesn't matter at this point. And back to our other two. You see detail when it's very close to you. When things are far away, you make out form, shape, basic color. That's all. To save your detail to the foreground. The lack of detail helps. Bob, Mario paint gives me trees. And very lightly go across. There. And instantly, we have some nice reflections. That's simple. Just a little waterline. Bob, why does mine not look like yours? Back in here somewhere. We don't know where it is. Right there. Big old tree. But he's a nice tree. There he is. All right, while well, I got that brush going, tell you what, maybe let's do something about like this. When I go home, the only power I have is over the garbage. I, I can take it to the street all by myself, but here, I can do anything. Bob, you're Absolutely crazy. Absolutely anything. All right. Boy, I said big tree. I wasn't kidding. This is a monster tree. Huge tree. And you could have done it with a two inch brush just as easy, but much quicker. I like the old fan brush. It gives you a little more detail. Load some color into it. 
Let's go back up in here and let's put a highlight or two on here. Evergreens are normally darker than other trees. So don't don't kill all the dark area in your in your evergreen. It happens sometimes. It gets feeling good and you don't know when to stop. I'm gonna take the little oval brush, dip it in some paint thinner. I'll go through some midnight black and some brown on one side. I want to load it full of color, I can. Then I'm going to take, and with the other side, I'm going to go, I got some light brown I made earlier. I'm just going to go through, see, like that. All right, all right. You got your brushes warmed up yet and you're ready? You can do this. You can do this, I know you can. I get letters every day from people all over the country that say they never believed they could paint and they're doing it. Their friends and neighbors don't believe it when they look at their paintings, but they, they are doing it. There, I'm gonna put a little stick, Liz, right there, a little old tree that you can do. And if you try it, I'd love to see some photographs of what you're doing. So if you have time, take a photograph sent to us. Let us hear from you. Until then, from all of us here, I'd like to wish you happy painting and God bless, my friend. Well, um, this is where we're at. I don't know how much more I can actually do. Well, here we are. Let's do this one. Oh, it's gone. Oh, yeah. Well, let's see what else. Let's see what else we got. I guess you can animate on Mario Paint. Is that what I'm saying? Put text on here. Stamps. Is this a DAW? What is this? No way. Think. What is this coffee? What is this? Oh, oh, bugs! Come here, bug! No! What is that thing? No! Ah! What the? F oh my god, why did you scream like that? Oh, I lost. All right, guys.
Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it per usual. If you liked the video, then like the video. If you didn't like the video, then get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I've been staying up later than the usual. Go delusional. Tell me how beautiful, how suitable for the trippy kid that's musical, that's getting everything that he puts his mind to. Give me time on the climb in my prime. Flip a dime. Now I'm in the crime. Do some time. I'll be fine. You'll be fine. You'll be sipping down and spun around. What's new with the whole crew? Like a G.